The Lubyanka building, KGB headquarters in Moscow. The sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker. Your only way in or out is through this high security elevator. We'll need proper credentials. That's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantown. He'll do it again. This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Man, I always find it so weird thinking, like, all this shit was happening 15 years before I was alive. Like, that does not seem like a lot of time. <laughs> but then it also seems like it's been forever ago. Hello, Belikov на трубке. Извините. Я думал, что это песок был Сингапура. Ah. Almost to the tunnels. Did you get access to the bunker? There's always a problem. Solve it. Hmm. Not yet. I know you have this under control. And one more thing. One of our East Berlin informants recently switched sides and fled from Moscow. We have reason to believe he's in the Lubyanka building today. He knows too much about our Berlin network. I'm thinking an early retirement. Yep, I'll put him down. Good man. Now I know why Hudson thinks so highly of you. We'll meet you at the basement entrance once you have the bunker key. Cool. Donna Belikov, you've been summoned to the conference room upstairs. Wait, why is he speaking in English? From the Central Committee. I just find it so funny that they have to give they just have to make them speak in English but they can just put subtitles. I'm sorry. You just have to come back tomorrow. Alright, so where would this guy be? Where would you bring in a defected spy? Probably not this early on. I doubt they'd make me want to snap somebody's neck so quickly. This is a beautiful building, though. I can see this being a good map for multiplayer. Ah, yes, let me in, good sir. Meow, meow. Comrade Belikov, have a seat. General Secretary Brezhnev has taken an interest in the new security development. Oh. Hmm. There's a mole within the KGB. The committee wants someone from the first chief directorate to oversee Colonel Kravchenko's investigation. If you've not met him already, this is Imran Zakayev. Thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. And thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. I can think of no greater tragedy than a home violated from the inside. The trust and love within a family is sacred. Apparently. Not everyone shares your beautiful sentiments. Comrade Belikov, as head of security, I understand you've practically exhausted yourself trying to unearth this mole. How has that gone? Ooh, that's a good question. Hmm. Oh, it's between one and three for me. I'm gonna say three. Yes. And once we are finished with this mole, he will be as blind and pure as his namesake. Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Zakayev, do you have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. We also want to... Cultivate closer relationships with all of you. I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, Belikov? 
Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation? The Comrade Belikov, my apologies. Even your bunker access has been revoked. We can't be too cautious, can we? Secretary Gorbachev, I believe it would be best if only General Charkov retains his bunker key for now. Fuck. Very well. See to it. Worry yourself no longer, sir. I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. Hmm. Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. Our collective, our very way of life is at risk. Well, in this case, that's a good thing. The traitor <laughs> will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. Well, they already know it's me. Or at least he knows. You can tell in his sultry voice that he's just like, Yeah, it's Belikov. But I'm not going to call him out in, pro in person. Because he's probably going to try to use me to get back at Americans because he's working with Perseus or some shit. Uh, oh. Okay. Ooh. This area is restricted. If I'm spotted here, I'll what can I do my for cover. You? Now I need to hide the body. Alright, that's one. Now what do I do? I guess I can hide him in here. How do, uh, there we go. Wait, that's how those lock? Oh, okay. Interesting. Alright, so that's perfect. That's what I wanted. Alright, now that that's done, now what? Uh... What can I do for you, Comrade Belikov? The General will be questioning a prisoner today, but should be available most of the time. Okay. Just let me know when you're ready to meet with him. I have a chance to kill Cherkov. Kravchenko's <laughs> office will have the poison I need. I, li I like the idea of uh, <laughs> of him saying this all uh, out loud. Okay, so I gotta go to Tr Kravchenko's office. So I'm poisoning the general, he's gonna go down. That seems like the most significant move to make, right? Like, I could just do all the other ways, but it's not. doesn't sound as cool. But this way I get to poison a KGB general. And be even more useful to American Pig Dog. <laughs> what is happening? Yeah, come on. There we go. Is this where I need to be? I don't think it is. Ooh. What am I doing in here? <laughs> where am I? What is this place? I, <laughs> I really don't know what I'm doing right now. I'm just in a room assassinating people. Oh, what? Why did he turn that way? Come on. Easy. Easy. Well, uh, what do I need in here? Nothing? Alright. I mean, they probably want me to pick up all the bodies and put them in there, right? Alright, in you go. Can I hide multiple bodies in here? You'd think this is good enough for, like, two, right? Nope, maybe not. <laughs> One at a time. 
Uh, evidence. I'll take that. Sweet. I stole somebody's watch. Anything else? There... Oh, can I hide him in this? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. The armory guard has a weakness for Cubans. Okay, perhaps a bribe could get me inside. Oh. Cool. What an accidental way of doing something right. I hear footsteps. Alright, I would. Oh, come on. <laughs> um, Alright, I, I don't know. Let's see. Maybe it'll tell me here. ND. So it'd be uh, 16, 75, 60. There we go. Nice. That is how we get poison for the job. Uh, I see. I could probably hide bodies in there too. But I'm not going to. They're going to feel just enough violated to be like, Okay, who did this? <laughs> Who's the one killing all of our friends? Uh, oh, hello. <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm one of you, I swear. What the hell? Oh, honestly, that looked like a Warner Brothers logo, and I was like, well, uh, what is happening what in Russia in the 80s? Of course. All right this way. Go ahead and take a seat. He won't be long. Yes. <laughs> no, tell Nikita no one else trusts him either. Why do you think no one wants I to play with me? I will my if you need anything else. <laughs> That's right. Yes, I am a busy man. Thanks for noticing. You too, you too. I'll call you tomorrow. <laughs> Dimitri? Oh, What's no. on your mind? Uh, um, um, um. <laughs> The same, mostly. Still begging me to retire early to the country. <laughs> Ridiculous. Isn't it? <laughs> home? <laughs> Moscow is my home now. If there was something before, I'd hardly know it. To us, Comrade Belikov. Two old warriors still stumbling their way through the dark. Oh my god. <laughs> Tell me, old friend, what are you really here for? Well, um... Please, stop playing me for a fool, Dimitri. I know you are the mole, and that it is this you're here for. What's next? Are you going to kill me for it? Well... The answer to that question is yep. Okay, now I need to head to the basement and let Adler's team in. Um... Uh... Uh... Uh, uh, um, can I, yes, pick you up. Yep, you are now in here. You should have given me the key card and not called me out for being a mole, so stay in the closet. <laughs> uh, this didn't happen. Oh, uh, this didn't happen. We're leaving this way. And away we go. Mm hmm. 
How did I not get caught there? What the fuck? <laughs> How? How? What just happened? How did I? How, how did I? How? Hi. How in the fuck did I not get caught right there? How can I help you, sir? Love you. Oh, this is insanity. Wait, this is the dude. This is the guy I want. This is the defector. I gotta do something to him. Stealth 150%. I mean, at this point, I'm pretty sure I'm wearing Harry Potter's cloak. Right, let's see. How do I get him? Hmm. Ah, our team will need uniforms to get that security. Luring two soldiers into the tunnel should be the trick. Huh. Okay. I think I have an idea then. Bielikov here. Send a security detail to meet me in the furnace room. Immediately. Wait, what did I just do? Wasn't sure you'd come through. I don't have uh oh! <laughs> uh oh! I called for backup? Oh no! Oh no! I'm letting them in, and I called for backup. What, am I? Tri am I? I'm. 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 I'm fake imposter. I'm third imposter. What the hell just happened? This oh, this ain't good. This isn't good. They're coming. What about you? I radio for him. Sounds like they're here. Well, I called for him. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. No. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I, uh, I don't want to talk about it. What about Napping. uniforms? Sounds like they're here. We're about to get those uniforms. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. Now, take cover. Keep it clean. Try to keep it clean. no good to us, bloody. I like how you can probably hear him saying that because of how far away I am. Wait, what? I just went for the... But didn't it tell me to do that? Didn't it just say go for the strangle? What about the uniforms? Sounds like they're here now. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. I guess I just don't do it. I just no. won't touch my keyboard and mouse. That seemed Keep really strange. Uniforms are no good to us, bloody. I know, but I went in for the, the kill. I thought you were gonna. Do There's only two of them, right? Okay, I have to leave, but you should have everything you need. Now, if stopped, you are reporting to Commander Sobody. Get changed. Okay. Are we just gonna toss their bodies into the incinerator? Nope, just right next to it. We could easily just burn the evidence, yeah. but we're deciding not to. Harder in the back. Faster than you, old man. Dude, this game feels so tense right now. Когда вы направляетесь, то смотрите обязательно для всех без исключения. Вы должны пройти досмотр. Well, 
Well, shit. Доставьте вашу сумку сюда для засмотра. Дайте он денег копиности. Дайте нам пройти. Принимайте это близко к сердцу, товарищ. У меня приказ досматривать всех, без исключения. О, oh бой. Товарищ, ты нужен за Кайву. Я разберусь. Спасибо, товарищ. Поступите, Белико. По-моему, я здесь, нет? Holy fuck, that almost went horribly wrong. And then I thought this was going to turn into, like, the biggest gunfight of the game so far. Where civilians would be in the way, I'd be getting shot, everybody's getting shot. This dude's already passed a checkpoint, and now he's being frisked again. <laughs> he went through the metal detector. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what the fuck? That awkward moment when you realize Adler is short for Adolf Hitler. No, it's Janjara Slyshel. Hell yeah. Кое сопединье, я как раз к нему на прием. Обязательно передам ему привет от вас. Assholes like that, we gotta watch out for. So wait, we could. I could have tried to knock him out. So what would have happened with that? Gear up. They won't be happy to see us down here. Wait for my word. <laughs> Won't be happy is kind of an understatement, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, looks like we're just gonna be killing everybody. Yeehaw! So far, this is going pretty great. Oh, that's my friend. Gas. What? Oh. There we go. Good. Let's get to the ball. Where's the okay? Wait, this is an MP5 I'm using? What the fuck? This thing's badass. I thought this was an assault rifle the entire time. Oh my fucking god. Oh, I couldn't get across. There's so many there. Jesus. Sounds like I got them. Oh wow, I actually did get up them. <laughs> nice. Good grenades on my part. What is this thing? Watch. 
Oh my god. I have a shotgun. Hand cannon. Copy it to a disc. I probably could have read all that. I think me putting in the floppy disk is what sets it back. Oh boy, okay. This is gonna be fun. Desk saves me from everything. Oh god. Well, they definitely did not get this desk from Ikea. Let's just say that. So is the entire embassy coming down to this? Because this seems pretty cool. These guys are going to go home and get so laid. And I just mean like with each other. There's no way they're not hard during all of this. Got the disc. Let's go. Cool. I got proximity mine. And I got full ammo again. Nice. Lock the place down. Follow me. This way. Did he really run across and get away? God damn, what happened to him? <laughs> he's permanently posed like he's diving over the thing. God damn it. <laughs> Why? Just cause. Yeah, we got proximity mines laid down behind me, so at least you got that. Oh, I probably should have used those in the fight. Hey! Holy fuckaroni, what the hell was that shit? This is like the most intense game of airsoft anyone's ever played. I don't know how they made it so that the campaign feels different in terms of gameplay than the multiplayer, but like the aiming in this feels more like Modern Warfare than the actual multiplayer does. Time for plan B though. Activate the gas. Oh boy. <laughs> I like how he has a cigarette in the middle of his pouch there between two clips. Smoky, can't quite see. Oh. 
Shouldn't they all be like passing out because of the gas? Ah! No, oh, Adler, get out of the way! Damn it, Adler! <laughs> but I wasn't even like playing a real game. It was always just a hardcore game of Team Death. I sucked ass at it. Or like casual. I don't know what they call that shit. It's been so long since I've played anything Counter Strike related. Oh, is there going to be evidence in here? Can I take this passport? No? I'll take those frag grenades. Hello, gas mask? Eh, I'll stick with the MP5. This thing's been pretty pretty good to me. Oh, are you kidding me? We're going to be in the big heavy thing now? Oh, <laughs> we're becoming them. Holy shit. Oh my god. Are we getting any, uh, airport vibes with, like, Modern Warfare 2 here? This feels like we're about to bust into the airport and just kill everything. <laughs> Let's go, Bill. Oh, shit. Dude, what the fuck? They're even walking in the same way. Oh, this is amazing. Oh. Dude. <laughs> I mean, at this point, it seems like it. <laughs> Holy shit. This is, this is great. I really hope this keeps going. This is amazing. Oh shit! <laughs> this is amazing! Holy shit! <laughs> That's awesome. I love it. Oh, this has got to be easily one of the best campaigns. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names. That was a fun exit. Himself. I liked that. I He's thought it was going to be very stealthy, like life. the rest of the game's Bell been so far. But no, that was that was good. I, I like that. that. Team I like that a lot. Too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out. One of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlock, Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus.